The names Ford and Falcon have been part of Australian motorsport since the 1960s and this weekend's final round of the supercars on the streets of Newcastle will see the swan song for the model. Tickford Racing will field four Falcons in Newcastle and team boss Tim Edwards is confident that his squad can be in the mix. You're only as good as your last race, so obviously to, to win the last race of the season, you know, obviously you get to enjoy the fruits of that for the whole summer break, but you know, we're, we've made some good progress for the car over the last few rounds, so we want to see that momentum continue, and that's obviously the best way to take us into the new year with the Mustang, um, but yeah, you know, you want to go out with a win for sure. Monster Energy Racing's Cameron Waters is looking forward to Newcastle and clicking over a milestone along the way. A few things are coming up for this weekend. It's my 100th race start um, and then obviously it's a Falcon send-off as well. So um, yeah, hopefully we can uh, get a few good results for both of them. Racing on a tricky street track is a challenge within itself, let alone not influence those in the championship chase. It's a bit tricky obviously with the championship battle and hopefully we're up the front um, right in the mix with those guys. That obviously means we're having a good weekend. Um, obviously for me, I'd prefer a Ford to win than a, than a Holden. Um, so. Yeah, for me, I don't really want to get involved in it, but yeah, obviously there's a preference on who I'm going to help. Although Sunday will be the final event for Mark Winterbottom with Tickford Racing, the team is looking towards a new beginning and the Mustang from 2019. Yeah, there's a fair bit of distraction from that while we're here at the workshop, but by the time we get to the race meeting, it is just 100% send this Falcon out on a high and try and win the race. Supercars hit the streets of Newcastle for practice from Friday.